are starting our day really slow. We slept in, we are very tired, we are very sore. That sunscreen we used yesterday did not work. I was lathered, I was covered, I was white. I had so much sunscreen on me, but I am, my back is burnt to a crisp. Same with the other kids. So we got another one at Costco yesterday hoping that it does a little bit better for us. But we so slept in, shot. we had a breakfast, we made those blueberry pancakes we got at Safeway. We had blueberry Ash, syrup, we had bacon, we had orange juice and bagels. It was quite good. We've taken our time getting ready and oh, and now we're off to go and shop at Queen's Market. And then I, I think we're it. going to go for a car ride and we're gonna go up to Waimea, I think, and get lunch up there and kind of check out that area. Try and stay out of the sun a little bit, kind of keep a little cover with clothes on and explore still. And then come back and go to the pool this afternoon. Uh, and Chelsea really liked being able to swim when there wasn't sun out, right? Well, I mean, yeah, it'll help. Help the sunburns a little bit. Plus it was kind of nice to be down there at sunset and not be so rushed like we were last night. Also, last night, I didn't really mention it, and I'm having a difficult time with my computer this morning. It's doing an update on my software update, and it currently says I have a whole day until the update is done. Um, so I have not finished editing yesterday's video, but we missed, missed not the last shuttle, but the we missed the shuttle by, what was it, like four minutes or something? Six minutes. Six minutes. And it was gonna be another half hour wait to wait for the next one and it, we were tired and hot and just wanted we needed water anyway so we walked home and it was easily like how do you think it was like more like a two uh, two mile walk <laughs> two, and it was a mile probably like a quarter mile it was not a quarter mile yeah, i walked well, a quarter no it was not a, we'll, we'll, we'll it was not it a quarter mile we'll it, it was not a quarter mile it's our fun. old bus stop was a quarter mile it was not a quarter mile well, i guarantee I, I you used the map and it was only a quarter mile. it was not a quarter <laughs> mile <laughs> minutes to walk two miles. Well, guess what? It doesn't take 20 minutes to walk a quarter mile. I used to walk that for the bus every single day. It was not a Either quarter way, mile. We'll map it out with the car. It'll be easy to map out because we pretty much will At 10 o'clock at night, it was really exhausting. It, it was wasn't 10 o'clock, it, it was, was 8 o'clock. It was exhausting. It was it exhausting. Like 11 o'clock at night and it felt like it was 10 miles long. You guys were all tired too. This one didn't I even have shoes on. With you. We're just been feeling trapped down on the floor. I don't know what for. Feels like I'm gonna lose. Silence takes a hold. I can't let it go. Chain up, no one knows. But I won't let the stormy seas put me in open water. Let me have my peace and lead me to tomorrow. When Okay, I'm always the one helping. We just had fun here at Queen's Market because it's really cute. She's like, why'd you get this bag? At that last store, at the Queen's Market. I mean, come on. If this doesn't scream like me, I don't know what does. But let me show you what else we got. This absolutely ridiculous, besides aloe vera. And yes, Abby was right. She knew we would need more. So we just bought it, but it wasn't expensive. It was five bucks, but 18 pack. <laughs> it was 18 bucks and we keep buying individual bags for $1.75 or $2. So we're actually saving money. The pineapple ones are not back at home. So I'm actually not gonna open that one. We're gonna enjoy that one when we get back home so we can have a little bit of a Aloha spirit um, back at home. Also, looked at patches to maybe start adding patches to my bags since the pins come off. Okay, we're gonna head over to, to Waimea. Right, yeah, the direction. miles, turn right onto Kwaihi Road. I think, let me just show you on the map. Okay, we're gonna play a little tour guide with you guys. We are right here in Waikoloa Village and we're gonna take this little highway over here to Waimea. And then there's a text drive-in that looks really, really good. And I think it's over here a little bit. So we're gonna go about 20 minutes, 30 minutes to this area and check that out and kind of see what it looks like, see if there's anything fun to do. And then we'll go a little bit further and go and see if there's other food and stuff over here and kind of see where we're at for lunchtime. But they say that the, the terrain is way different over in that area. So here's a look at what it is over here and then we will see what it's like on the other side. 
Okay, we're taking a quick detour to go and look at Hapuna Beach, get a lay of the land, because this is a beach that we are definitely going to come to, but I've got to find some boogie boards. We all love to boogie board, and it's not really worth doing a beach like this, I think, without a boogie board. So We also didn't show, but Chelsea got some new Crocs. They got cute with pins. They're cute. Her other shoes were having, we were having a lot of stress with them yesterday, right? So we're going to go down here. We're going to check out Hapuna Beach. I think we are seeing waves that we're going to want boogie boards, right, Chels? I know they look a little small, but they'll do. They'll do. Yeah, I think this is something. I don't think we need to go all the way down to know that we're wanting to come back, right, Chels? I don't think we're going to go all the way down. I just wanted to see it and get an idea of what we need to bring back. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is the for sure. Yeah. But we're gonna bring as much as we can. Like, we're gonna bring gear yeah, and food, and we're gonna come and stay, right? Those are good boogie board waves. Yeah. That's worth trying to find. Yeah. So that's a yes. Um, I think we actually might even check out the like, Goodwill. I'm on all these uh, pass it along Facebook groups for Hawaii, but I have not seen any boogie boards being offered up. So I'm gonna kind of stock that. Also, I might be a little MIA for a second while we drive. I will try and film the scenery, but my sisters and my aunt are going to do a little video call. A little Google Meet. My aunt likes to kind of be mom now that my mom is gone and check in with her girls. <laughs> or the girl nieces that she has and she likes to make sure we're all doing good and check in. So I'm going to do that call. <laughs> they're do they're all doing it after work and for us it's like not even lunch time <laughs> we're like four hours off from them but that's okay we're just gonna be in the car First of all, we'll talk about this a little bit later, had no idea. I didn't really trust that it was gonna be this green on this side of the island. It actually truly is super green. Two, just had a hard part of a call with my sisters. I was mainly just kind of listening just because we were in and out of service, but got to an, a hard part of the conversation and then I lost coverage. But also sightseeing with family is not easy, especially with a husband who doesn't like to trust that I say, say right, turn right, turn right, turn right. Are you sure? Are you sure? Oh, we should have turned right and now we're lost. <laughs> or we didn't go on the right street. And then it's my fault that everyone gets mad at me because I said that's what we should do. Just going to put that out there. That's why I'm out of the car right now and they're parking and dealing with themselves because I'm kind of, I'm kind of done being the bad guy all the time. So we're going to put that aside and we're going to enjoy this wonderful little landscape and go to Tex Drive-In. We're gonna get some lunch and then we're gonna get some malasadas and get on track. Okay, just um, reference a family of six eating at Tex Drive-In. <laughs> Not for the faint of heart. Um, yes, you can have my phone. But I wanna go look in this cute little gift shop right here. You wanna go look in there with me? Okay. And of course, then, Ashley finds a squishy in Hawaii. And then, those are cute. A little alien. I think. <laughs> your, your other friend like would like it. Alien. All right, here are the malasadas in all their glory. We got three chocolate ones and three Bavarian cream. Yeah, you can have one after we eat your hot dog. Okay, you got a hot dog. Okay. Show your burger real quick. Little uh, Hawaiian burger. <laughs> 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 
So Kaylee just found the coconut and wants to crack it. But I'm pretty sure you're not gonna find anything good inside that coconut. I think it's like dead. But it's cool. Alright, so now we're here again at the little bus stop kind of thing. Kids and everybody. We're gonna head back over to the pool and have fun, plus catch the sunset. And Kaylee's gonna come over later, but otherwise we are just gonna have another nice night at the pool. So you actually end up staying here at the Hilton Waikoloa Village, or at the Kahalo, like we are, or at King's Land, which are the other two hotels that you can stay at that are Hiltons, and give you full access to this wonderful resort. There's nothing bad about a view like this. There's not, except don't bother working out <laughs> in the morning. You will get your steps in and more. It takes so much walking just to walk from one end of the resort. Our shuttle dropped us off right up here, okay? The pool is either clear up there, up by that hotel right there, or clear back on the other side of the island, or other side of the bay right over, clear over there. So, just know that you're gonna get your steps in. And, <laughs> kind of exhausting, but it's worth it. It's just kind of hard with all your gear and all your stuff but we're gonna we're gonna stay on go on this side where we were at last night for the sunrise sunset I'm already tired <laughs> um, it's a little quieter over here a little less busy another day we'll go back over to that other side and uh, hang out on that side as you can see we're a little bit tomato red so we wanted to kind of come when right when the Sun was gonna go down give us a little bit of reprieve but still get some warm weather pool time in without having the risk of a sunburn. I, I hold on to this storm cause I need to be swept away, swept away. Left again, left again oh. 